Can you imagine going on an adventurous motorcycle trip without a camera that would capture the moments, sceneries, and the memories of your journey for you to glance back when you are feeling low? Sadly, it used to happen with our classic motorcyclists a decade ago, when all they had was a piece of paper with some notes written about their journey. There are a number of different goods available, each with unique features, advantages, and budgets from which to choose the motorcycle helmet. I conducted a lot of research, read a large portion of reviews, and put up a list of the best motorcycle helmet cam from reliable brands to assist you in making an informed choice. Following extensive investigation, I suggested that these products are quite beneficial for persons like you. Check out my description if you want to learn more about the price and other details. Let's start the video right now without any hesitation. Number 1. The Casso Brave 7. We all know the problem with GoPros. If you purchase a new action cam, you not only have to dig deep into your pockets, but you also have to buy almost all of the accessories separately. Things are quite different with the Casso. The Brave 7 costs just about half compared to the GoPro 8, and comes with almost everything you need to attach with your motorcycle helmet. So, by introducing Brave 7, the Casso fulfilled its promise to deliver a full-fledged action camera that costs just around $170. Featuring a 20 megapixel CMOS sensor, the Casso Brave 7 provides good quality photos and videos, as tested by our team of writers. There is a maximum video resolution of 4K, which by the way has become customary in New Year action cams, a 6-axis digital image stabilizer, and a 2-inch touch display at the back, followed by a mini 1.4cm display up front to let writers capture exactly what they need to. You can choose between 4K at 30fps, 2.7K at 30fps, 1080p at 60fps and 1080p at 30fps. If you want to record slow-mo videos, you can choose 720p with 120 full frames, or you can choose between 720p at 60fps and 720p at 30fps. Besides the slow motion mode, the specifications also include a time-lapse mode. Plus, in writing mode, the camera turns on automatically as soon as it is connected to the USB charger, and the bike is started. Moreover, the video length can be set to 3, 5 and 7 minutes. In addition, you can also adjust the exposure, sharpness, balance and select from various preset settings and filters. Number 2. The Casso EK7000 Pro. GoPro's industry-leading cameras are known for their image quality and ease of use, but even the cheapest production camera costs well over $299. That's where the Casso EK7000 Pro comes in, being one of many inexpensive alternatives of the GoPro that costs well below $100. And while its price is really impressive, so are its features. With a 2-inch touchscreen display, the Casso EK7000 Pro Action Cam features an IPS panel with liquid crystals arranged in an overlapping pattern, providing a precise reproduction of each individual pixel. This results in less color distortions, wider viewing angles and higher brightness. The camera records moving images in Ultra HD or 4K at 25fps and 2.7K at 30fps. Photos are captured at a resolution of 16 megapixels, which might be lower than that of other action cams, but are perfectly ideal for personal use. And thanks to the camera's waterproof housing, the K7000 Pro is resistant to water up to a depth of 40 meters. And in addition to the several mounts and waterproof housing, the K7000 Pro has a wrist-mounted remote control that can be used to control the camera on the go. This remote comes with built-in Wi-Fi, which is fairly easy to enable in the settings and pairs quite effortlessly. Once activated, the two-button remote can be used to start and stop recording, as well as capture still images. As a handy bonus, the camera automatic number 3. Insta360, Go2. In 2019, INSTA360 introduced the first version of their Go Action camera in a compact format, with surprisingly good recording quality and great stabilization. However, the recording time was limited to a maximum of 3 minutes, making its application limited to certain situations. The successor Go2 basically features a similar design, but with a redesigned charging case and 150 minutes of recording time. As for the camera's size, it is just about 53mm in height, 23.6mm in width, and 20.6mm in thickness, including the lens cover. With a weight of 26.5 grams, it measures about the same as your motorcycle keys. As such, the Go2 is a few millimeters larger and about 8.5 grams heavier than its predecessor, but it is still tiny compared to a conventional action cam. But that's not all. The case also features dual buttons and a small screen, allowing the INSTA360 Go2 to be operated while it is in the case. In the case, the action cam performs just like a full-fledged camera offering several features and sufficient battery life. Moreover, the action cam can also be mounted on a tripod or selfie stick. As an alternative, the Go2 can be detached from the case and can be controlled via smartphone using the INSTA360 app. Another great convenience of the INSTA360 Go2 is that it is magnetic. 
This means that it can be quickly and easily attached to numerous metallic objects, as well as can easily be hooked up to the accessories included in the package. The image sharpness is absolutely stunning, and even the full HD recordings, 1920 x 1080 pixels, look rich in detail. And while the GoTo does not support 4K resolution, 3840 x 2160 pixels, this can sometimes be seen as an advantage, since the internal memory lasts for a very long time. Number 4. Camp Park Stream. Not everyone wants to spend hundreds of dollars on a motorcycle helmet camera, just because they can afford it. To add to this, we often are skeptical about these devices, especially when using them for the first time. Buying quality helmet cameras without spending good money is quite difficult. But thanks to Camp Park Stream, you can own an action camera that is cheap, yet equipped with all the features you may need during your adventure. This camera is very popular amongst motorcycle enthusiasts, not because of its low price, but for the impressive advantages it has over other high-end cameras. Sure, you won't have a lot of accessories available in the market from this brand, but if you want to record your rides without spending too much, Camp Park Stream is your answer. And in case you do need to add some accessories, most of the GoPro mods are compatible with it. And while 1080p is usually sufficient for video recording, the device is capable of recording up to 4K, which is pretty impressive considering the price. With a 20MP image resolution, it can shoot somewhat similar photos as captured by other expensive action cams like the Hero 8. However, do note that it lacks voice control. Aside from this, it comes along with two mounting brackets, one for bike and the other for helmet, two rechargeable batteries, each of Number 5. DJI Action 2. The Osmo Action 2 is a sophisticated action cam in a very compact size. But unlike the INSDA360, the Action 2 doesn't just focus on size, but also on high picture quality, as well as a wide range of functionalities. And while the manufacturers of INSTA360 already had a modular action cam in their lineup with the 1R, but that camera always included at least two additional components. The Action 2, on the other hand, works without any additional attachments. It is housed in a cube-shaped hard case with a 1.76-inch touchscreen on the back, and a centrally placed control button at the top. The small screen is crisp, thanks to a pixel density of 350 ppi, that is sufficiently bright even in broad daylight. And despite the small size, its touch operation is surprisingly good. Meanwhile, the technology behind the Action 2 remains as good as the competitors. It records videos in 4K with a generous 4096 x 3072 pixels, and up to 120 fps, frames per second. For an even smoother experience, you can switch to 2.7K HD, and then even film at 240 fps. Furthermore, the maximum recording bitrate is a decent 100 megabits per second, which is good for action-packed recordings. Plus, the entire rear panel is equipped with a 1.7-inch OLED display. All in all, if you are looking for a small, lightweight and unobtrusive action cam for your motorcycle helmet, DJI's Action 2 is the right choice. Its modular design is ingenious, it is equipped with the right accessories to suit every type of motorcycle rider. And if desired, it can be turned into a selfie cam with magnetic modules that have a second screen. In terms of video- That's all from my end. I regularly produce review videos. So do subscribe to my channel. Kindly check my description if you require any additional details or want to know the price of the goods. Comment below if you have any problems of any choice. Stay current with our latest products because they will make your life more simpler. Thank you for watching.